the Titan string bow. This bow is so powerful, it makes honor mode a joke. Bruh. You can get this bow as early as Act 1. Just check out this damage. Nice. No, seriously, it's making my solo on a mode run a cakewalk. A yo. Right, so you're wondering how do you get the Titan string? There's actually two methods. I'll start with the most common one first. First, you beat up some doggos. Rickon will talk to you. That's if he's still alive. Talk to Mummy's Arrows. And finally, you can purchase it from Brem. I personally buy it from the bugbear at Moonrise Towers. I'm using this method for my solo round AK. The Titan String Bow. It's a plus one long bow that also adds the strength modifier to damage down. I know it doesn't sound like much, but listen to me, Aura. Right. On top of the bow's already decent damage, it adds the dex modifier. It then also dips into your strength, the damage. Wait, it gets better. If you use a special arrow, it dips the damage another time. That's not too bad for Act 1. To get the most out of this bow is pretty simple. You just need to drink a strength elixir. If you're sober or just lazy, find the stool in the arcane tower. This chair. I feel stronger just from sitting in it. Smash that stool. The strength vanishes as soon as I stop moving. For the club of hill join strength, this is pretty much a stat sting. It sets your strength to 19. This is not a build video, but I can give you some suggestions. I personally go Gleamstalker until level 5, then I'll swap over to Swords Bard at level 6. Here are two recommended build videos. One is my Stealth Archer video. I pretty much break the game from level 7. That's like late act 1, early act 2. And the other video I recommend is from a dear friend of the channel, Stealth, who did a really awesome OTK assassin build. Both links are in the description and pinned comment. Also, he did the math on the time string just to give you an insight on how much damage this bow can do once it's properly set on. Full figures in a turn, really. Anyways, here's some Titan string gameplay to convince you that the bow is goaded with the sauce. Enjoy. I recommend doing the spiders at level 5. The spider mummy can be a run ender for honor mode. So here's a little trick you can do a run. You can shoot these eggs on the run. I mean, there's eggs on the left, but I'm just gonna go for her now. Chan, that was so cracked. I mean, look at her health. This is over, Chan. On turn for Mummy Milkers, good damn. I guess we're really gaming, now. Eh? Yeah, just time string things, I suppose. Let's go for the hunters first. Don't worry, Chan, we're just deleting everyone. So I opened up with Hunter's Mark and I got a surprise round. Okay, let's open with a Hunter's Mark. Who's the strongest one? They're all pretty weak, so it doesn't really matter. Okay, let's just dunk on everyone. Mummy Milk is just deleting people left and right. Even if it's oh god, she's got a, um, That's worth some coin. bigger personality, I guess. 45 damage, not too bad. Yes, blame the damage numbers on a mod, not like, um, a clearly fought out build. I'm just gonna do a sweep of this Act 1. Cause you know, I've got the ADHD mood and I wanna kill things. I think we can kill him on this turn. What's gonna happen to scratch everyone? What if I cough really hard and my index finger um, kind of came down? You know, this is kind of fun killing things. Just a casual 50 damage, not too bad. Ready. 
So the trick here, Chad, is to open. So we have a surprise, Rian, which is good. That's right, Chad. She'll hit an attack one day. I'm gonna turn off um GWM here. Okay, now Miss Milkers can go to town. I mean, that was pretty clean. We still have the surprise round. Alright, I'm gonna go now. See ya.